Good evening. This is a short little video is for fans of Jed Henry's project. The, uh, <laughs> this is the rickshaw cart print you can see here. And this is one of the color blocks. The carving is going to happen in uh, three basic stages. The first step is using the knife, the one we call the hangito, to go around all the outlines of the design. The design that's here pasted on this piece of wood was made from the key block that I've already finished carving a few days before this. I printed some blank copies from that, colored in, you can see there's sort of a yellowish green here, colored in the areas that I want to keep for this particular color block, pasted it down on a fresh piece of wood, and I'm now cutting it. And there are going to be 10 of these in the whole set for the whole group of different colors that make up this print. It's done on very, very thin paper, and we're actually looking at it from the back. These lines are showing through, but in order to make some of the parts even clearer, I rub them with a bit of oil. You can see it just pops right out. The wood used for these color blocks, it's a similar kind of cherry, Yamazakura that I used for the key block, but it's a bit softer. It's not necessary to be hard to carve delicate lines because we're carving on all flat areas rather than thin lines. So we're here now at the end of the, the first stage of this cutting process, which was to go, as I said, which was to go around all the outlines of the area we want retained. There's four zones on this block. And now the fun begins, so I'll get my big hammer out, as yeah, you can't see it here, and uh, I've got a few gouges and uh, chisels that I use now to remove all of the waste wood around the areas that I want to retain for printing. It's noisy work. The big chisels sometimes leave a lot of uh, pretty rough edges down there on the wood, so I've got a few flat chisels that I use uh, to clean up all the rough roughness in there. Those rough areas would catch ink and catch pigment later if I left them like this. And this is the last step. I know I cut around the edge of these areas earlier, but now we're trimming off with very fine small chisels, trimming off the last bit of waste wood up close to the edge of these color zones. So there we are, the last few strokes. Nice beautiful clean block now. There's four areas that will be used for printing colors on the rickshaw cart print. Thank you for watching.